Good morning, good morning, saints of God. This is a day that the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in it. I know we usually have morning prayer much earlier, but today, just a little bit later than usual. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Today, we're just, we're just praying. We're just giving God glory and praise and honor. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory to God. Worthy is the Lamb. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory to the King of kings. Glory to the Lord of lords. Glory to the great I am. We love you. We adore you. We worship you. We honor you, Lord God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Hallelujah, hallelujah. God is so good. God is so good. Hallelujah, hallelujah. He has been blessing me. He has been healing me throughout these prayers. And I pray the same for you that you're going through your healing, your deliverance, any and everything that needs to come out that God is ministering to you. That he's developing you. That you're growing continually. Hallelujah. We love God. Hallelujah. His supernatural power. And his supernatural grace for our lives. We love him. We adore him. Because he is almighty. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He is everlasting. Hallelujah. His love for us is deeper than the ocean. Hallelujah. His love for us is wider than than anything our eyes can see even in the skies hallelujah his love for us is infinite hallelujah hallelujah and we love him because he first loved us hallelujah we adore you lord we worship and honor you hallelujah we are yours and you are ours hallelujah bless the lord all our soul and all that is within us Hallelujah. We thank you, Father. We thank you. Thank you. Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We ask, Father, that everything that is in us that isn't of you, Father, take it out. Have your way in our hearts. Have your way in our minds, our souls, our spirits. Have your way in us, Lord. Yes to your will and yes to your way. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We say yes to you. We surrender our all to you. We take up our cross and we follow you on this day. We take up our cross daily and follow the Lord. We surrender to God daily. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We thank you. We praise you. We honor you. Hallelujah. Direct our steps. Order our pathways, Lord God. Yea, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, we will fear no evil. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. And every tongue which rises against us in judgment is condemned in the name of Jesus. The Lord said, this is our inheritance. It is our right that people do not talk about us and do not tear us down. Do not speak against us. Do not do us wrong. Hallelujah. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. People who may try to dig ditches for us. Hallelujah. Like Hammond tried for the children of Israel to, to um, have a killing, killing and, and mass, do mass killings of the Jews. And the Lord turned it around on him. The Lord, Lord turned it around against him where he was not able to annihilate an entire group of people. We give God praise and honor for that. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. God is going to turn things around in our favor. Hallelujah. In every area where the enemy has used someone, hallelujah, to come up against us, God is turning it around. Hallelujah. We thankful, Lord God, this is a time of favor and answered prayers and open doors. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We thank you. I decree and declare and I thank God, hallelujah, for giving us the mindset to receive what it is that he has for us. Hallelujah, hallelujah. 
We give you glory, praise, and honor, Lord God. There is none like you in all the earth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He said if we abide in him, we can ask whatever we have. His word abide in us. And we, he abides in us and his word abide in us and he abides in us. That we can have whatever we ask. And whatever it we will and it will be done for us hallelujah because god loves us hallelujah god we thank you for the favor over our life that brings us promotion and increase your favor is restoring everything the enemy has stolen from us hallelujah and producing honor hallelujah in the midst of our adversaries hallelujah we thank you lord god for back to back favor we thank you lord god hallelujah that you're flourishing us with favor favor is on our lives you have blessed us with favor we have favor with god and men we have favor with god and people we have favor hallelujah to be promoted we have favor in the name of jesus hallelujah hallelujah for doors to be open we have favor we thank you lord god for favor on our lives that those lord god that you call to be a part of our life that they will be obedient lord god we have favor hallelujah we thank you lord god that you cancel the assignment of the spirit hallelujah of, of rejection in the name of jesus and he's us dealing with a spirit of rejection and it's more than a spirit that tries to make you feel rejected and make you think that you're being rejected when you're not this spirit actually have people to reject you for no cause no reason and you're wondering what happened that's a spirit hallelujah lord god we thank you for counseling the spirit of rejection over our life I decree and declare the spirit of rejection have no power over our life. No weapon formed against us shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. We are accepted. We are God's beloved. Hallelujah. We are accepted in the kingdom of heaven. Hallelujah. God does not reject us. Hallelujah. God embraces us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He said, even if your mother and father rejects you, that God is there with you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We praise God and we give him thanks for it. We thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. For the miracles, the blessings, the favor, the honor, everything that you're bestowing upon us because you love us. Hallelujah. Not so much that we deserve this perfect thing, but Lord God, because you love us, you're elevating us, you're promoting us, you're growing us. And Lord God, because of our prayers, because of our prayers to you, because of our consistency, because we work for the kingdom of heaven. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah. That you're loving us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah. That you're protecting us from our adverse adversaries. Hallelujah. I decree and declare that none of us even receive what the enemy speaks in our ear. If the enemy used someone to tear you down, if the enemy uses someone to say, you're not going to make it. If the enemy used someone to say, you're not going to do this, you're not going to do that. If the enemy even um, attacks you while you're down, while you're feeling down, and they laugh and mock at you when you're down. Hallelujah. Know that God will lift you up. And it's nothing the enemy can do. Hallelujah. The enemy might even try to be your friend. Hallelujah. And try to get in your face because they see what God is doing. And then they'll be they'll regret how they treated you. They'll regret how they mishandled you. But we're not going to worry about those things because our eyes are focused on God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Even if they regret it. Yes, we walk in forgiveness and we love from a distance, but we still have the power to say no. We still set healthy boundaries. We don't have to allow people back in our lives because they feel bad about what they did. God did not call us to that. He said if they ask for forgiveness 70 times 7, yes, we are to forgive. He did not say we have to reconcile in relationship. Christ have made it I feel like a lot of Christians have made it made a mistake and, and that there's a level of ignorance on the part of reconciling with a brother or sister or with family now if it's the desire of your heart and you pray to God and that person agrees that's one thing it's nothing wrong with that but there are cases when someone even if they change to a certain degree there are certain things that people have crossed the lines and boundaries that you just the bridge is burned 
you can't allow them back into your life it doesn't matter if they did change sometimes people change and that's great for them but you still can't because of the level of disrespect that they have done and then there are times you know that you know people they may have changed in certain areas but there are areas where you know they haven't changed they may change in certain areas but then when you talk to them and you listen to them they're still tearing people down they're still gossiping about others they're still in everybody's business but taking care of their own you know they know more about what's going on in everybody's life hallelujah than they know what's happening in their own life you know, there's some people you cannot reconnect with. You have to use wisdom, godly wisdom. Check out their fruit. Hallelujah. A tree cannot bear good fruit. And it's a, you know what? A good tree can't bear bad fruit. And a bad tree cannot produce good fruit. It just doesn't happen. And sometimes we think people are elevating and they're growing. Hallelujah. And it looks like it because they prayed hard for it and they've had other people pray for it. And things may come and it may seem like they're growing and great things are happening for them. But then do they even have the character to keep it? How they have they dealt with their character issues? And some people are going around denying the character that, they, that needs to be changed in them. Some people are going around pretending that their character isn't a problem in their relationships, in their connections and everything that they do. So they go around, they might have blessings and, and doors open, but are they able to keep it if they don't have the type of character to keep it? Hallelujah, Lord God, may we have the character, may we have the integrity, may we have the heart of God, may we walk in love, hallelujah, so that when we're dealing with other people, we're dealing in connections and we're, we're having conversations with other people, hallelujah, that we are being a blessing to others, hallelujah, that we're not going around talking about people, tearing people down, and then when we get elevated, we're doing those dumb things. Hallelujah, that will destroy the destiny that God has for us. No. However, God is telling us to build, let's build wisely. Let's build with wisdom. Let's build with the, the, the I want to say the law, the law of love. Hallelujah, in our hearts. Let's build with, the, with our tongue. Hallelujah, edifying and, and building others up in the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord God, give us wisdom in knowing who, when we, we're down, who we can disclose our life to, who we can open up to, help us not to open up to everybody. You know, when the broken part of us may open up to any and everybody and not realize we have to set boundaries. But Father, help us to be healed. Help us to have boundaries, Lord God. Help us to walk in wisdom. Help us, Lord God, not to just lay our hearts and give our hearts to any and everyone. Because we're loving people and we're walking with Christ. Hallelujah. Help us to walk in wisdom, Lord God. Hallelujah. When we're giving, hallelujah, our parts of ourselves, Lord God. Some of us, hallelujah, are just open, hallelujah, to any and everyone. Hallelujah. Help us not to be that way, Lord God. In the mighty name of Jesus, it's not that it makes us a bad people, but it makes us vulnerable people. And we don't want to be too vulnerable to any and everybody. Give us wisdom. Hallelujah. Even Jesus, out of the 12 disciples, had three he was the closest to. He wasn't as vulnerable with all of them as he was with the three. And there was one that he was even more vulnerable to than the other two. Hallelujah. So Lord God, help us to understand the levels of friendships and connections and relationships and who and how we allow people to get close to us and what we um, disclose to people. Give us wisdom in those areas, Lord God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Help us not to be so quick to think because people smile in our face, hallelujah, that they're actually a friend, hallelujah, just because they talk to us or, or we have some deep conversations on moments, don't allow that to make us think that all of a sudden that we are actual friends, hallelujah, Father, bless us with mutual beneficial friendships and relationships and connections, hallelujah, people that lift one another up, Lord God, hallelujah, people that will see Hallelujah, and want to see the good in us. People who want to see us elevated. 
not people who are jealous and intimidated and want to tear us down and see the worst in us and always looking for the bad. We don't need those type of people around us, Lord God, or people where it's one-sided, where we're always seeing the good in them and helping them and elevating them, and they're coming in our way, tearing us down, looking for the worst, getting jealous and intimidated by what you're doing in our life. We thank you, Lord God, for stopping those who are destiny blockers, those that the enemy is actually using, and they're under the guise of we're here for God. We're here to be a blessing to you because that's what God told us. If God told someone to be a blessing, and if they really had a relationship with God and they really feared God, they will not come into your life tearing you down. Those who really have a relationship with God and operate by the Spirit of God and walk with God, hallelujah, and walking in wisdom and love God, they're are not coming to to be um, um, negative, nasty, and to say mean and evil things when they see you being elevated. No, they will be blessing you. They will be saying nice things. They will not hesitate to bless you. So we thank you, Lord God, for the, revealing the truth in us, and Lord God, for helping our eyes to see the truth in people, Lord God. And give us wisdom as we walk and as we deal with different types of people in different circumstances. Jesus said that if we speak to our mountains in our life in faith, hallelujah, by faith, it will be removed. Hallelujah. So we speak to our mountains right now in the name of Jesus. So everyone put it in the comments. Speak it out loud. Hallelujah. Repeat. Say, I speak to the mountain of and fill in the blank and say right now. Hallelujah. And we command you to be removed in the name of Jesus. We speak to the mountain of lack and we um, command you right now, hallelujah, to move in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We speak to the mountain, hallelujah, of the spirit of rejection. Hallelujah. Right now. And we command you to be removed in the name of Jesus. We speak to the mountains, hallelujah, of attacks from the enemy, hallelujah, right now, and we command you to go in the name of Jesus. We speak to the mountains, hallelujah, of self-sabotage, hallelujah, and people sabotaging us. We speak to those mountains right now, and we command you to be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We speak to the mountain of fake friends. Hallelujah, right now. And we command you to be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We speak to the mountains. Hallelujah. Of even bad thoughts. Hallelujah. To be right now. To be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We thank you. We speak to our mountains. We speak to the mountains of the enemy coming into our marriages and trying to separate us from our spouses. Hallelujah. We speak to these mountains right now and be removed in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We speak to the mountains of wayward children. Hallelujah. Who are disobedient, doing whatever they want. Hallelujah. Going against the will of God. We speak to these mountains right now. Be thou removed. We decree and declare that our children will be obedient to God. They will. Hallelujah. Everything that we planted in them, the word of God will not return to God null and void. Hallelujah. We plant the seeds of love. Hallelujah. And the word of God in their hearts. And they will not depart from it. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 We speak to the mountains of debt. In the name of Jesus. Right now be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We speak to our mountains. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. That they are removed in Jesus mighty name. Hallelujah, I decree and declare that we are the head and we are not the tail. We are above only and we are not beneath. God says that we are blessed and so we declare blessings over every area of our life right now in the mighty name of Jesus. We are redeemed from the curse. We are redeemed from the law. We are redeemed, hallelujah, 
Hallelujah. We are redeemed of the Lord. We are redeemed from rejection. We are redeemed. We don't receive those things. We don't receive the lies of the enemy. We do not come into agreement with what the enemy has said and what the enemy is doing. We do not come into agreement with the enemy coming back into our lives to dis- cause destruction, to cause um um distractions in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. To bring fear into our life. Hallelujah. We cancel those assignments in the name of Jesus. We come out of agreement with what the enemy is doing in the name of Jesus. It doesn't matter what he's doing. No weapon formed against us shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. It doesn't matter what he's doing. Hallelujah. 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 Greater is he who is in us than he who is in the world. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we thank God for it. Hallelujah. 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 We are redeemed from any and all curses spoken. All evil altars built against us. Every evil word spoken. Every evil word written. Every evil spell against us. Hallelujah. All those, hallelujah, who came to spy on us. Just so they can go report to others. And so they can say bad things about us. Hallelujah. Really not even caring about us. Want to to tear down what God is doing in our life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. No, the Lord is building us up and no one can stop it. The Lord is blessing us and no one can stop it. The Lord is opening doors and no one can stop it. We come out of agreement with what they say. We come out of agreement. We don't care about what they think. I decree and declare we no longer care about what people think. That we come into the full fruition of what God has called us to be. What God has called us to do. I decree and declare that we are bold soldiers for Jesus. That we walk in Holy Ghost boldness. That we boldly become everything that God called us to be. Hallelujah. We're not listening to no devil. We're not listening to no naysayers. We're not listening to our enemies. We're not listening to our frenemies. Those pretending to be our friends. And they really want to see the worst in us. Hallelujah. We're not listening to anybody. We're not listening to family members and people who say, Oh, you can't do that. That's um, um, irrational. That doesn't make sense. We're not listening to those people. We're listening to what God says. What God says about us. What God said is right. What God said is going to happen. Hallelujah. That's Those are the things that we hold on to. And if people don't agree with it, oh well. They didn't agree with Noah. Hallelujah. They laughed at Noah. Now what if Noah stopped because of their laughter? What if Noah stopped because they mocked him? Noah would have been gone right along with them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But Noah didn't listen. He listened to God. Hallelujah. And saints, that's how we have to be. We have to be like Noah. It doesn't matter how ridiculous it is. It doesn't even matter how ridiculous it looks. It doesn't matter if other people haven't heard of it. It doesn't matter if other people don't agree with it and think that it's ridiculous. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. What matters is what the Lord says. And if God tells us to do something that looks ridiculous to everybody else, even if it looks ridiculous to us, hallelujah, we will do it in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter what other people think. It doesn't matter what they say. Hallelujah. Because their tongues and their mouth will be shut or their tongues and mouth will drop down low and they will gasp and they will be in awe. And oh, we should have listened. Hallelujah. Because just think about how the people, when it started to rain and Noah shut the door, how they banged on the boat begging to come in and it was way too late. When it's way too late, then they want to believe. Hallelujah. When God tells them something, they ignore God until it's way too late. Because the window of opportunity was shut. Then they beg God, open the door, Lord. Open the door back to this opportunity. We should have listened to this. We should have listened to that. We should have listened to this promise. We should have listened when you said, if we do this and that, you're going to bless us. Or to do this, even when you didn't explain it. Had we obeyed God, what would have happened? Had we obeyed God, but now it's too late. Now it's too late. We don't want to be, hallelujah, like the people on the outside of the boat. Hallelujah, we praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We bind every spirit that is hindering us, that is trying to hinder our breakthrough right now in the mighty name of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus over our lives, 
over our breakthrough, over our anointing. We plead the blood of Jesus. We lose every spirit. Hallelujah. Every spirit of manifestation in our life. And we declare that God is making all things new. Hallelujah. We release everything that God has for us. We release the promises of God. The promises of God are yes and amen. Hallelujah. Lord God, release the promises that you promised us. Lord God, we are coming before you. You, Lord God, because we know, hallelujah, that you are not a man that you should lie, nor the son of man that you should repent. Father, remember us. Remember us and keep your promises toward us. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I decree and declare that we are in a season of open doors and new opportunities. Everything that has been stagnant in our life is moving and flowing in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And I'll speak that over the natural and the supernatural. Hallelujah. If even our blood flow in our body, if it's been stagnant, I decree and declare that it is moving. Hallelujah. And we operate by faith, by exercising. Hallelujah. I decree and declare in our life, hallelujah, if we've been stagnant in our businesses, if we've been stagnant on the job, hallelujah, that there is movement. Hallelujah. That we do what we're supposed to do. Hallelujah. That we're doing the natural and God do the supernatural. Hallelujah. Any stagnation in our life because of the enemy. Hallelujah. We decree and declare that those powers are null and void in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We cancel those assignments of the enemy in the name of Jesus. Father, send confusion in their camp that they will no longer be able to hit us. Hallelujah. Again, in the same way, with the same target. Hallelujah. With the same Hallelujah things. Lord God, help us, Lord God, to break away. Hallelujah. From from habits, Lord God. Hallelujah. That keeps and patterns, Lord God, that keep us bound and stuck, Lord God. Hallelujah. And stagnant. Hallelujah. Loose those things over. Hallelujah. We break us free, Lord, now in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare that we are broken free from bad habits. Broken free. Hallelujah. From um, doing the same things over and over again. Not realizing we're getting the same results. Lord God, break us from habits. Lord God, of stagnation. Lord God, break us from habits. Lord God, that's keeping us bound. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Break us, Lord God, from even speaking words over ourselves. Cursing ourselves without realizing. Break us from those habits, Father, in the name of Jesus. And may we only speak life to ourselves. Life to our circumstances. May we not speak those things that we see. Hallelujah. But speak those things in the unseen realm. Hallelujah. As it is, hallelujah, in heaven, so it be on earth in our lives. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, as it is in heaven, so it is on earth in our life. Hallelujah, hallelujah, so be it unto God. Hallelujah, everything that God says about us, let it be, let it be, so it be. Hallelujah, may we be like Mary the Virgin and says, hallelujah, as the Lord says, so let it be unto me in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, I decree and declare that we are in the season, hallelujah, of open doors. Hallelujah, new opportunities, new doors, hallelujah, new breakthroughs, hallelujah, new friendships, new connections, new jobs, hallelujah, new businesses, hallelujah, if, I, and if we have a business, hallelujah, new strategies, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, new friendships, new connections, new divine connections, hallelujah, new favor, in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you for the new in our lives, hallelujah, we thank you for the open doors, we thank you for season of favor we thank you lord god hallelujah that we have this hallelujah for this day forward in the name of jesus hallelujah hallelujah we command every enemy of our blessings hallelujah every hindering spirit hallelujah hallelujah we command you to go in the name of jesus hallelujah hallelujah every hallelujah spirit we we command you to cease we command you to desist in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, we command you to stop in the name of Jesus and go back to the dry places and never come back again in the name of Jesus. We command you to go in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah. I decree and declare that we are not hindered, that we are flowing in the promises of God. The promises of God is flowing in our life, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I decree and declare that we live in the overflow. We live under an open heaven where it's always consistently raining and showering blessings upon us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
I decree and declare that we will be so happy. We will be so elated that the enemy will not be able to stop it. The enemy will not be able to block it or hinder what God has for us. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We decree and declare that we are strong in faith. Hallelujah. We are bold to step out. We are bold to go forward. I decree and declare we are confident. We are confident in Christ. We have confidence. Hallelujah. We are not um, shrinking back. We are not hiding our light. Hallelujah. We are not hiding our light under a bushel. Hallelujah. But we're letting our light so shine before men that they will see who God is in us and through us. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We walk in Holy Ghost boldness. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost boldness. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Hallelujah. Dominion power. God said that we have dominion. He has given us dominion over this earth. I decree and declare that we're walking. Hallelujah. In our dominion. Hallelujah. He said that we're to take charge of this earth. He said that we're to take dominion. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Father, may the sons of God not even allow the children of obedience, disobedience, I mean, that we don't allow the children of disobedience to to rule this earth. You told us to have dominion, Lord God, because you have given us dominion power. Father, hallelujah, the enemy is even using other people, hallelujah, to still have some level of dominion over this earth. Hallelujah. So, Lord God, we pray of, over our lives and over ourselves as the body of Christ that we walk in our dominion power. Hallelujah. And that the children of disobedience no longer have rule. Hallelujah. Because this is not their dominion. We're to have dominion. In the mighty name of Jesus. In every area of our life. In the mighty name of Jesus. We walk in supernatural power. We have supernatural authority. We will not be intimidated. We will not pull back. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We will not resist. Hallelujah. We Hallelujah. We'll resist the enemy. Hallelujah. But we will not allow. Hallelujah. We will not shrink back or resist. Hallelujah. Our power and what is ours, our authority. We will not be less than who God called us to be. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We will not shrink back. Hallelujah. But we will forge ahead. Hallelujah. As mighty soldiers of Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord God, that our blessings will manifest. Hallelujah. We thank you that doors are being opened. Hallelujah. We thank you for answered prayers, open doors. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We declare that we are strong in faith. Hallelujah, we are bold to step out. We are confident. We are fearless. We are faith warriors. Hallelujah, we are warriors in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, we don't back down. We don't give up. We never quit. We are immovable. We are unshakable. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, we are anchored in the Lord. Hallelujah, we're not intimidated by people or situations. God said, don't be afraid of men and their faces. We're not afraid of people and their faces. We're not afraid of what they, how they're looking at us. We're not afraid of how they think about us and what they're thinking about us. We are not afraid. Don't be afraid of men and their faces in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We curse every insecurity. Hallelujah. Every root to the root in the name of Jesus. Everything, hallelujah, that stemmed from our childhood. Hallelujah. Heal those areas, Lord God. Hallelujah. And we cast every spirit, hallelujah, that's attached to childhood traumas, childhood, hallelujah, abuse. Lord God, we cancel those spirits in the mighty name of Jesus and we loose your hold over each and every person in un- under the sound of my voice in the mighty name of Jesus. We curse every sin, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus and every addiction, hallelujah, that's trying to hold us captive in the mighty name of Jesus. We curse it to the root in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare no more setbacks and hindrance in our flesh in the name of Jesus. We subject our flesh, hallelujah, our flesh, hallelujah, is subject to the Christ, hallelujah, in us, subject to Jesus, in us, subject to the Holy Spirit, hallelujah, we die to our flesh, hallelujah, and we live according to the Spirit, 
hallelujah, fear. You have no, hallelujah, dominion in our life. You must go in the name of Jesus. Spirit of intimidation, you must go in the name of Jesus. You have no authority in our life. Insecurity, go in the name of Jesus. You have no authority in our life. We don't re- entertain, hallelujah, what it is. We don't attain what could have, should have, would have, hallelujah, but we move forward. Hallelujah. We live in now and we move forward. Hallelujah. And we don't entertain any sin in any area of our life in the name of Jesus. We stand on the goodness of God in our life. We stand on the promises of God in our life. We stand by faith and not by sight. Hallelujah. Our faith sets us free. Hallelujah. Of fear, doubt, and insecurity. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have faith. We have faith. We have faith. Hallelujah. Our faith is limitless. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are more than conquerors through Christ Jesus. Every red sea in our life, we command you to part. Every Lazarus in our life, we called you to resurrect. Every Goliath in our life. Hallelujah. You are a defeated foe. Hallelujah. Be cast down and destroyed over our lives in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Dry bones. Hallelujah. You shall live. We speak to you and we command you to live. We command you to rise up. We command you. Hallelujah. To be strong. Hallelujah. We speak to dry bones. Hallelujah. Say you are moistened. You are strong. Hallelujah. Our muscles are strong. Our spiritual muscles are strong. Hallelujah. We are strong in the Lord and in the power of our might. Hallelujah. We shall not fail. Hallelujah. We shall not be hindered. We shall not be stopped. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 I decree and declare that we don't even respond to everything. Hallelujah. We don't respond to what people say. Hallelujah. Let them talk. We will keep our peace. We will hold our mouth. We will hold our tongues. Hallelujah. Every curse and anything that anyone thinks that they speak over our life will turn into a blessing. It's all working out for our good. Everything is turning around in our favor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are great. Hallelujah. We love ourselves. Hallelujah. We are walking in our purpose. Hallelujah. We love ourselves on purpose. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are minding what we say. We're not speaking against others. Hallelujah. Because God said to even bless those hallelujah, who curse you. Hallelujah. So while we're blessing them and they're trying to curse us, hallelujah, it's working out for our good because God's going to turn it around. It won't work. It won't work. No matter how much they think they hinder, stop, and block us. And they think, hallelujah, that they, we need them. And they think, hallelujah, we need them in order to grow and be blessed. And they have arrogant pride toward us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Those things are cast down in the name of Jesus. Only what God says prevails. Hallelujah. We don't need people, hallelujah, who are disobedient, hallelujah, to what God is saying in their life. And I, I, I was thinking, hallelujah, years ago, God has called this woman, I remember, to be a spiritual mother in my life. And she refused because she didn't want to do the work. She had in her mind that, oh, no, this is going to be hard. I don't want to do this. And she just did straight up disobeyed God. And God was like, there's something in you, hallelujah, that will be a blessing to this woman, something that this woman needs. Hallelujah. And the woman refused because of her own selfishness, because of her own pride, because of her flesh, because of her thinking in the natural. Hallelujah. That's why, hallelujah, we're going to make sure we're not those people. Hallelujah. And sometimes those people think, yes, God may have wanted to use them, but guess what? God said no weapon. Sometimes God will turn things around. Next thing you know, those people will be needing you. Sometimes, hallelujah, those people will be needing somebody, even if it's not you. Hallelujah, they'll need somebody and that person. You know, sometimes people reap what they sow. They'll be needing someone and, and someone will not be there for them when they're in need. Not that that's what we wish, hallelujah, but those are the seeds that they sow. Those are the seeds that they sown. And then sometimes people want to try to come back, but it's too late. But we deserve to be blessed. Hallelujah. Don't be afraid to say yes. 
God wants to bless us. Thank you, Lord. Yes, God wants to bless us. We deserve it. Some of us go around and we think it's humility, but we're speaking against the blessings of God when we say, we don't deserve this. We're just lowly people. We don't deserve God's blessings, but he decides, no, no, say thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for blessing us. God wants to bless us. There's a reason why he feels that we deserve it at this time, or maybe just because he loves us. Hallelujah. Just because he loves us. He wanna, you know, parents want to give good things to their children. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Good parents want to give good things to their children. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So hallelujah. Hallelujah. We will be bold in Christ. Hallelujah. We will do whatever it takes. We will be mighty soldiers of God. Hallelujah. And we will hallelujah walk in our blessings and our authority. We will not pull back. We will not withhold. Hallelujah. We will not withhold what God has told us to do. Hallelujah. To make other people comfortable. To make other people feel good. Hallelujah. Whether they cry, throw tantrums or not, it doesn't matter. We will not cave in or quit. In the name of Jesus, we will not give the enemy our power. I will say that again. We will not give the enemy our power. Hallelujah. God has given us the power. Hallelujah. And we will walk in the power that God has given us. Hallelujah, in the mighty name of Jesus, we will not do what our first mother and father have done. We will not give our power away. Not to anybody, not to any demon, hallelujah, not to any evil spirit. We will not give our power and our authority away, hallelujah, but we will walk in it in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord God, that everything that the enemy think that he stole, hallelujah, that it will be manifested back into our lives sevenfold in the name of Jesus. It will be returned to us sevenfold in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And we thank you, Lord God, for all these wonderful prayers, decrees, and declarations, and that they will come to pass. Hallelujah. And we thank you, Lord God, for the love that you bestow upon us each and every day. Father, forgive us of all of our sins, of every word, thought, and deed that wasn't pleasing in your sight. Lord God, we forgive those, hallelujah, who, hallelujah, didn't obey, who didn't align with what you called them to do, hallelujah, in our lives, as well as, Lord God, forgive us because we may have done it. Any number one of us may have done ourselves. But Lord God, may we walk, hallelujah, and knowing better, hallelujah, and the resurrected power, hallelujah, as we continue to um, to conform ourselves to your word and your ways of doing things. And as we continue to learn from you and grow and develop and have wisdom and understanding and knowledge in you, Lord God, and your ways and how we are to do things the right way, hallelujah, that we become better and better and better and growing in you, Lord God. Hallelujah. And that old things are passed away and behold, all things are coming new. Old things, ways of doing things, hallelujah, have passed away. Old ways of surviving have passed away in the mighty name of Jesus. We're no longer living in survival mode, but we're living in thriving mode. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. And I praise God for each and every one of you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If there's anyone under the sound of my voice who wants to receive Jesus as Lord and Savior, repeat after me. Dear Lord Jesus, I ask for your forgiveness. I know that I'm a sinner. Please come into my heart and come into my life as my Lord and Savior. Take complete control over my life and help me to walk in your footsteps daily by the power of the Holy Ghost. I turn away from my sins, hallelujah, and I follow you. Thank you for saving me. And for answering my prayer, I receive you as my Lord and Savior. In Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen, amen, and amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, amen. Hallelujah. Know that God is excited. He loves you. Hallelujah. I love you in the Lord, but God loves you so much more. Hallelujah. Everyone be blessed on today. Hallelujah. We are excited for your new birth. Say no to the world, the flesh, and the devil, and say yes to God always. Read your word every day. Pray to God every day. Surrender every day. Ask God for forgiveness every day. Hallelujah. And you will continue to grow in power and authority. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name.